Good morning, everyone. It is Diana, and it is Monday, Labor Day. You know that Labor Day weekend is in full effect. And right now, I'm in the Panera parking lot waiting for Denise to get her croissant. We are on our way to the studio. We were supposed to upload this vlog yesterday on Sunday because that's our, like our um, that's our usual day to upload our vlogs. But one of the videos had a claim on it. So I have to go back into the studio and change the music and delete that song that I have on there because that is the reason why we have to claim, which kind of sucks because I was excited to put out this vlog because it was actually a full week of vlogging. So yeah, we're gonna run over there real quick. We don't really have anything planned for today. No barbecues, no nothing. That sucks for being Labor Day. What did you get? I got a grande non-fed ice caramel latte with extra caramel drizzle for today. Pop. Those are the studio flow drinks for the day. So I they called you. Yeah. When I was in there, they called me. Um, Oh, it's like if I say my real name, they always get it wrong. Then if I say Dion, they'll either get that wrong. But a lot of the time, like recently, they got my name right because I just been saying Dion. But today, the lady called me Devin. It's my future daughter's name. It was. It's new. I never got that one. I usually always get Devin. I think it's like fate, though. Like Devin or Dan Danny. Danny. Yeah. I've never gotten. It. I've always gotten Deborah, Denora. So I stopped saying Diana. I just say D. And I'd be like, or all right. Denny. But Diana is easy too. It's easy to pronounce. So I can't see how she got that wrong, but I guess it don't matter these days. And I don't know why they even ask anyway, because the names on your, especially when you pay with your mobile app, the name shows up when you're drinking yeah, anyway. Yeah, last week because he didn't ask me my name. And then when he handed me my drink, it said Denine on it already. Yeah. And I was like, oh, so they already know your names. But I guess, you know, you might not always be paying with your own card. Like sometimes I might go in there and I might have your card with me if I don't have my phone or something like that. Oh, I need 40 cents. Uh -oh. I think yeah, I got quarters got in the um, cup holder. We'll talk to y'all later. The other day, oh. I'm talking to you two in the vlog, Sean. Oh, but um, we uploaded the vlog and we had a copyright, so now we have to come back in and change the song. My shoe look like my Tim boot. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Like a size 14? Dwayne wear? No, I think he wear 13 or 12. Girl, that's still big. Yeah. The raw right yeah, there. Wait a minute. So we're doing that now. Why are you putting them on your feet? 
یاری جوت هست نیم بگیری که باید جوت It is hot out here. I'm putting the cup in there. All right, we're just finished up at the studio. We were in there with AJ, Sean, and Tony. It was a good little vibe session. I didn't expect to see them in the studio today. They don't need mopeds or what's that thing? It's a dirt bike. They're dirt bikes. No helmets on. With no helmet. Silly for you. Left off the vlog yesterday with us leaving insomnia cookies and those are all gone but today I have to go to the gym because all those cookies are gone um, I did work this morning so now I'm home I have to get ready for the gym <laughs> Bye. 
as you and I, but we're, it's obvious we're not. I don't think we're right for each other. Yana's with us. They um, recommended the place to go to. It's like soul food. George, what is it? There's George so is many it? places to go when you're in a mini city. You want to try everything, but you just have to pick one. And it's hard and to pick one. for the best. <laughs> Hopefully it's good. No. I'll take it to the table. You are. You are.
Good morning, everyone, and happy a car. It's like every time I turn on the camera, a car comes. But happy Thursday. I did not close out the vlog yesterday, which I'm trying to get better at. But we did get back from DC pretty late, so oh girl just went to sleep. But we had a great time yesterday. But today is a beautiful day. It's a little breeze, but it feels really good outside. I'm wearing shorts right now, so um, it must really feel good. This is what I'm wearing. Nike everything, but my top. I, I got this hoodie from Urban Outfitters. Kind of stole this look from Deneen. Um, it's these cutoff hoodies from there. It's like cotton and they feel really good and they're comfortable and they're warm. But yeah, I just wore this over my Nike uh, outfit today. But right now we are on our way over to the gym. But yeah, so I'm just waiting on Deneen to come outside. I've been out here for like 15 minutes already waiting on Deneen. But I'm excited to work out today. It is a really beautiful day. Another car. I need to buy a mic for this uh, camera here. One more. Viewers, I know a lot of our viewers definitely watch Insecure, but. I wanted to introduce the song of the week today after our workout, which is Insecure by Jasmine Sullivan and our man Bryson Tiller. It's called Insecure? Yeah, it's called Insecure and it's on their, you know, little EP or whatever they want to call it. But I would definitely check out that track. I've been playing it all this week mainly. It's coming up on my um on my playlist and things like that. So definitely check out check out that trick and we're actually on our way to starbies of course after our workout because i'm craving another coffee even though i had one this morning but you know you can't go wrong with a post workout coffee you know what i'm saying it's psl season guys yes deanna's hype on the pumpkin spice i'm actually not a huge fan of pumpkin spice lattes because um i feel like starbucks has way too much flavoring in it for that one but yes we didn't take today's workout only because we did back stuff again today, back and shoulders, and most of the workouts repeated themselves. And Deanna and I also kind of did different workouts. So we decided to save our workout footage for probably tomorrow when we do abs. legs, oh, abs, yeah, cardio. everyone it's Friday it's like 5 30 in the evening and I am just now picking up the camera to vlog I want to apologize for that for some reason I wasn't thinking this morning to actually film my first workout which was a three mile run nothing crazy but I did work out already today and now I'm getting ready to make myself a cup of coffee to work out again when Deanna gets here she should walk in at any minute so today I also wanted to share some new leggings that I picked up. I actually decided to be a little bit adventurous and purchase some leggings that are outside of my comfort zone, which are usually my Nike leggings and some Adidas leggings. So I purchased some Gymshark tights and they're not that bad. However, the band is super duper high. And I'll put the camera up so we'll have a better view of them. So I purchased the Gymshark seamless leggings and I definitely 
I probably would purchase another pair of them. They just, I just, I'm not a huge fan of the large band that comes right across. It literally covers my entire stomach. And if you want to be super snatched and a pair of leggings when you work out, I would definitely recommend these Gymshark seamless leggings. But I'm not a fan of the band, which I decided I can just roll it down a little bit to where I'm comfortable with them. However, I do like them. I ran in the other day. I thought with this fabric, the run would be hot. However, it wasn't. It wasn't too bad. Still breathable. My legs weren't suffering or sweating too bad in them. And they actually gave me a lot more to give when it came to sprinting at the end of my run. However, I am a fan of them. I would per probably purchase them again. However, I wouldn't rank them over my Nike leggings. I will be a Nike leggings girl forever. I can tell you that. <laughs> Mackenzie! You came to visit us today? Uh-huh. Are you excited? Uh-huh. You about to play some kickball? Nope. What are you about to do? Play hide and seek. Oh, play hide and seek. Okay. Um, how old are you? Four. What's your favorite thing to do? Play basketball. She a baller, y'all. These are questions answered by a four-year-old. That's our new little segment. Yay! <laughs> Yay! But she came to hang out with us for a little bit today, so we're excited. Deneen's excited. Woo! <laughs> she is so funny. <laughs> she is hilarious. What did you tell me when we were coming down the steps? Chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we just left the house. You know how long it takes to put shoes on a four-year-old? And she wanted chick she wanted Chick-fil-A and then also she went to attend the mall too as well. So to us when we were having to, she was like she made the whole she's like guys we're gonna she gave us a whole uh, rundown of what our day was gonna be like we're today. But she's so her. funny. It's okay. We got you, sis. I love the fact that she's she wants to be active though. I can't be mad. She yeah. wants to go and do things and sweat and run like kids are supposed to do. So all with it. Oh um and she wants Washington, to be a ball player. See, um License plate. I feel like every time I see a DC license plate, randomly, I feel like that's it's where a you sign, should be. We know? love DC, y'all. We didn't even like, want to come home on Thursday. I feel like that's where I need to be. And ever since we've come back home, that's all I've been seeing is DC license plates. Is it a sign or what? No, but you're trying to tell, you're trying to tell me. us something. Go walk 